Hello boys and girls, welcome to ALD. Now we are going to do some writing today. So we're going to need a piece of lined paper and you can use a notebook. You can use our paper that looks like this if you'd like. Um, but something that has lines, right? Because we want to remember when we're writing our capital letters, we're starting out all the way at the top of this black line, coming all the way down to the bottom of this black line. Most of our lowercase letters are going to be all in this area, right? Right up to this dotted line, right? Sometimes you'll have a stem, like in an H, or you'll have a daredevil, like a P or a Q, that hangs off a little bit. Most all will be in this little area here. We're gonna practice that, along with practicing our spacing, right? And we're also gonna take our time, right? There's no rush to get through here. So I want you to practice your best, very, very best handwriting today as we write. Now, what are we going to write? Well, that's a very good question. We are going to go back and review some spelling words that we have done already, but with a little twist to it. Now, what spelling words are they? They, let me tell you, uh, let me just find my, can't see, I don't know where my marker is. Um, oh, hey, super monkey. Excellent timing. I needed this. I couldn't find mine. Thank you for me. Well, I do have super hearing. Super hearing? I can hear you from way over there. All the way over there? Yes, all the way over there. I am Super Monkey. Yes, you are. And you came in the nick of time. Thank you very much, Super Monkey. No problem, Mr. T, but now I must go and help other people. Bye. That was quick. Well, thank you very much, Super Monkey, wherever you are. He has super hearing, so he can hear us. Remember that, boys and girls, he could probably hear you too right now. All right, so let's get to it. Our spelling words that we are reviewing for this week are fast, F A S T. Fast, we could describe Super Monkey as fast, right? Super Monkey is very fast, right? We have try, T-R-Y, and trip, T-R-I-P, trip, good. And we also have hot, H-O-T, fog, F-O-G, and get, G-E-T, and men, M E N, and we have wing, W I N G, and we have pink, P I N K. All right, so these are the words that we have for this week. Now, fast, try, trip, hot, Fog, get, men, wing, pink. What are we going to do with them? Well, we've already drawn them, drawn a picture and written them out. Then we put them in a sentence as well. Well, we're going to step that up just a little bit. We're going to get a bit of a challenge this time. So we are going to write sentences again. But this time, I want you to use as many of these words as you can in each sentence. So if you can use two of them in a sentence, that would be awesome. Maybe, maybe somebody might be able to add three words to one sentence, but we'll see. I'm thinking two is probably going to be it. We'll see. So we could come up with, we use two in every sentence. We could have one, two, three, four sentences. Can we do that? Yes, we can. We're going to do one together right now. So we look at fast, try, trip. Get, fog, hot, men, wing, pink. So, what should we do? We brainstorm. Okay, what can we write? What can we write about? We can write about something being fast, trying something, going on a trip, something being hot, maybe some fog. Get, get fog, get fog. How about if we said, we are going to get fog. Like if we were 
talking about how was, uh, the weather was going to be, we could say, well, we are going to get fog. Let's do that. We are going to get fog. Now, first thing we do is capitalize the first letter of this sentence. It's a brand new sentence, so we are going to get some fog. We starts with w, w. W. We are A R E. Now there's space going G O I N G. We are going to T O. We are going to get G E T fog F O G. Here we are. We are going to get fog. And here are our two spelling words right here. We are going to get fog. Now, it's your job to continue writing on this page using these spelling words. Now, if you need to use the same spelling word in different sentences, that is fine. That is fine. I want to see how many you can write. How many words you can fit in a sentence of these spelling words. Let's see what we can do, okay? So, we're going to go for at least two. Can you do it? Are you up for the challenge? I'd like to see four sentences written today, boys and girls, okay? All right. I'm going to let you get to it. I can't wait to see what you come up with. Maybe we could even share some next time here at ALD. We'll see you real soon. Bye-bye.